Hey guys! In this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install and use Eclipse IDE on your Ubuntu operating system. So let's get started. Step 1. Install Java on your Ubuntu operating system. Because Eclipse is a Java-based IDE, you'll need Java Runtime Environment to be installed in order to run it. First, open the terminal. Once the terminal is open, you can just run the following commands to install the open source version of Java. So once you have Java installed on your Ubuntu operating system, we are ready to install Eclipse. Step 2. Install Eclipse. Open your favorite browser and go to this page to download the installer. Link download Eclipse IDE in the description. So once this eclipse.star.gz file is downloaded, I'm going to just minimize my browser, and I'm going to open my terminal once again. Now I'm going to just navigate to my downloads folder. And you can see this eclipse.star.gz file is here. So if you are comfortable with command line, then you can give this star command, and then hyphen 15zf, and then the name of your file which is Eclipse. Now you will be able to see that this folder is extracted from your Eclipse.gz file. And now inside this Eclipse folder, I can see this Eclipse-inst file. So let me clear the terminal. And then I need to navigate to the Eclipse directory. And here I need to run this file right. So I'm going to just write dot forward slash name of the file which is Eclipse-inst and then press enter, and it's going to start this graphical installer setup. If you want to install Eclipse for the Java development, you can choose the first option. If you want to install Java for other purposes, 
for for example for developing C++ applications, or PHP applications, or other applications, you can choose the option which is suitable for you. Now I am going to choose the first option which is for Java developers. Accept the licensing terms and choose the default installation folder. Once downloaded and installed, click Once downloaded and installed, click the launch button to start the program. And this will be the location of your Java JDK file. So Eclipse is going to recognize the location of your Java JVM JDK directory where you have already installed Java right. When the app launches, you should be able to configure it for your environment. This video showed you how to install Eclipse on Ubuntu 20.04. If you find any error above, please use the comment form below to report it. Thank you. 